Island School introduced its laptop program with Year 8 in January 2009. The phased introduction was designed to allow gradual view of approaches to teaching and learning year by year. The school decided to allow students and their parents to choose their own model laptop within a broad specification. This approach recognizes that students' needs and circumstances are different. The school has supported varied and numerous opportunities for staff training. This video views both teachers and students to explore the reasons why laptops and connectivity add value to education in the 21st century. Advantages for students having laptops in lessons are fundamentally about connectivity, connectivity to the resources that they need when they need it, um, possibly in the language that they need it in, in an international context that can be important, uh, to, the diff to different types of resource, uh, to support people's particular learning styles. Some people perhaps are you know, more text-based learners, some people are more visual learners. With multimedia technology, you have the ability to access those kinds of resources. Laptops are there really to support learning and nothing else. And I think at the moment, uh, we are busy ourselves sort of trying to manage what it, what it means to have these new technologies in, in, in our rooms with each individual student having their own. And I hear lots of people saying, and just the other day I was on a workshop on, uh, on Saturday, somebody said, you know, you wouldn't, you wouldn't send students off to a room just for, to get some pencil lessons, you know. And we have to move away from the boxes, in other words, the laptops being the focus. The focus has to be the learning, and that's why we've introduced it. Well, first of all, I think it's good because it cuts down on paper. Um, I think, obviously, it, it's increasingly what students are familiar with and comfortable with using, uh, using technology. So hopefully uh, it allows them to continue in, in, a, in a format that they actually want to be using. The idea of having to write and constantly be using paper and pens I think is less and less appealing to many students. The ability to research and learn on the fly, learn what they need to know. Access to a diversity of opinion, I think, is, a, is another important advantage that laptops give students, particularly in the humanities subjects, for example. So it's, it's those kind of generic advantages um, in terms of research, in terms of kind of critical thinking skills. You've also got the ability to present work in a number of different ways. Um, and that's also a significant advantage with computers. And laptops can be used really, really uh, powerfully to support students with English as a second language because they can access resources in their mother tongue. The holy grail in education is trying to differentiate personalised learning so every student gets the experience in the classroom they need and they want. With laptops they can access resources at their own level, they can learn in different ways, they can manifest their understanding, demonstrate their understanding in, as a video, as a, a presentation in different ways. And, you know, again, the laptops are there to support learning which is efficient and is effective and, and helps students to achieve their best. They're not there as an end in themselves. And they, are they popular? Have you read any reviews for that other So what I love about laptops is that you can use them to collaborate and um, it gives us instant access to almost anything. So if students are carrying their laptop and we have an inquiry and we're not really sure what the answer is, we, have a, we can get some immediate feedback. What would be great is if we got to the point where all textbooks were on students' laptops as well, so instead of carrying around all these heavy books, all we have is our laptop to carry. I think the, the main benefit for English is the obvious one. Um, we don't have to go to a computer to uh, let them all word process their work. Um, not so long ago, there were two or three computer rooms in the school, and we maybe forgot that it used to be very stressful difficult trying to book and also slightly odd you leave the classroom for a different room with a different setup um, whereas now uh, word processing work or doing other work um, it's just part of the normal lesson. In history it's also good in the sense that in class they can access a wide um, variety of sources through the internet or if it's, we as teachers find big colourful pictures and we can email it to students or we can put it up on the screen and they can look at it later. It means that they have access to, to those as well instantly in front of them. I think it's actually more important for students to engage with technology in a, in a 21st century technology rich environment 
the laptops per se are just a current version of technology which is evolving and changing um, and it's important to for schools to engage uh, and, to, and to educate students in the use of technology to support learning. I think it's good that students have laptops. Yeah, I've got there are some problems in the courses, but um, I'd say on balance it's better that we have them than that we don't have them. Yeah, definitely. There's so many advantages to using laptops. I mean, carrying a laptop over so many books is just so much easier. And the battery life you get on nowadays, on computers nowadays is just so much better than, you know, carrying books to school. With a laptop you have endless resources, whereas books have, it's just like one book, one book, one book. You know, with a laptop and access to internet, it's sort of an endless source of uh, knowledge and it's easy to access. And for assessments, um, the more we use computers, I think the more better grades we have. And it's faster and then more writing. portable than simply yeah. using desktops at home. And it looks cool. So using a laptop allows you to use a range of different softwares to create a range of different products and it just gives you a lot more variety. Yeah, like in math, you can use autograph to uh, make graphs that might be hard to uh, sketch using using hand methods. Um, geogebra, uh, kind of stuff. Yeah. My handwriting isn't that good, especially when I'm trying to write fast. So using Word helps me write a lot faster and it's really neat and organized. Yeah, Microsoft is really easy to use and it's way faster to type than to write. You have access to Google Docs, which means you can work together with other people and you can share ideas on one single uh, piece of work. My bag is pretty heavy, I tell you. And just by bringing one laptop instead of five more books is a lot easier on me. I do work faster in class, although I get distracted sometimes. But nevertheless, I type faster, spell check, always make sure I'm right. I like that the fact you can organize your work so much better and so much safer than as you would on a piece of paper. You can save work, you can look at work, work you can refer to work, you can email your work to friends. It's just so much more easy uh, to work on a laptop rather than on a book in class. I think using laptops in class is pretty useful. In classes such as art, I use Photoshop to edit images and basically um, make my artwork better. If I, need, if I need desperate resources somewhere, if I haven't done my homework and I need to literally just go over something, find something, I can just do it on the internet. It's really simple. Yeah, I find the laptop program really good because we can do research during class and at the same time ask our friends questions if we're stuck on the internet. Uh, we can also save a lot of paper even though it uses electricity, but I think that the laptops Help us do a lot more research. I don't, I don't, I don't waste any paper when I use it. I don't have, I don't have to carry around huge files or anything to, um, to hold all my notes. I just literally just put it in one, in one, in, in, in my laptop, and that's it. I keep writing. It's kind yeah, of and annoying. And it's so tired. Yeah. So There's like a portable kind of like writing. And it's the 21st century, so we need. Insert. If you go to File, sorry, if you click on.